Did you know we went to Tokyo? Well, we went to Tokyo. Oh, I think he likes you. Guys, if you're not subscribed to our second channel, GP and Julia, you're missing out. We're trying all the things. Gold ice cream, yakisoba, onigiri, sushi, ramen, takoyaki. And what better thing to try in Japan than McDonald's? McDonald's? <laughs> We must play this video to learn how to make our meal. Who made that video? We did. Oh yeah. We got a bunch of requests from you guys of which ones we should make. This is it, the FBI. <laughs> which, there's actually shrimp in there. I see a little mac sauce, a little lettuce leaf. So what we're gonna do is take our shrimp and put them in a bowl. We got our flour, add a little bit of egg in there, add some pepper, a little bit of salt. We're basically binding this all together to make a shrimp patty. Bubba Gum would be proud. All recipe details will be on healthyjunkfood.com as this is the first time we're making this. We don't know what we're doing. We're making a shrimp patty. Actually, this is what we should be looking at. This is the perfect picture. But look at that, Julia. That's a pentagon. Can't I just make a circle? Why do they gotta make it a hexagon? Pentagon. Pentagonal. Oh my god. If it's any consolation, your nails look lovely. That's what I do for YouTube. Little houses on the hillside. Little houses made of ticky tacky. Name that TV show. That's not bad, Jules. Thank you. All right, guys. While these freeze, subscribe to JP and Julia. <laughs> what did you do? Ooh, mac and Cheetos. And they're done. It's been two hours, guys. Can you believe that? Those are some mighty fine looking pentagons. All right, let's bread them. Basically, we're tossing it into an egg wash and then pinko, because if you look at this picture here, that's pinko, or at least we think it is. Oh boy. Uh-oh. There it is. We're putting a timer on, three minutes. They're already getting color, baby. Hey, are you guys home? Um, is there a tornado really coming? Does it look really dark and bad out there? Clear skies. That's what's coming up. Tornado. Oh, oh my, my god. What the heck? I feel like a Stay puff Marshmallow Man should just come climbing around that building. So once it gets to be in the color we want, it's done. Here's the flower one, here's without. They both look good. I honestly don't think you need the extra flower. Not at all. There's one last thing we need to do. Killed it. Aww. There's just one last thing we need to do. Build the sandwich. <laughs> Bottom bun going down on this lovely Healthy Chunks of Board. And a perfectly shaped fish patty. Hashtag Pentagons for life. Lettuce leaf going down. And then of course, the signature mac sauce. Yes, yeah, some of those dehydrated minced onions. Good job. Nice manicure. I mean, that looks good and all. But it doesn't look like this. You did it, Jules. You made it. That looks so good. It's good. I really do like tartar sauce better than the mac sauce with this though. Mac sauce is for a cheeseburger. JP, you come try it. Dude, this just brings me back to when I was like 25. This tastes like a fish stick on a sandwich. Mmm. This feels like fast food. Oh my mama. JP, come here. Come here. You shouldn't be outside during this. Here it is. The shaka shaka, guys. So basically what I'm really about here is the breading. Look at that. Let's pause. It almost looks like a waffle. Double, maybe even triple breading on that. Perfect world scenario, I would be using white bags. Come on now, it's hip to be brown. Guys, comment below if your parents send your lunch to school like this or if you used to. Guys, comment below, uh, who puts their 40s on that? First step for the shaka shaka, grab up some chicken breasts. Beautiful, we're putting this chicken on a diet. You know what we're doing right now, Jules? It's called the butterfly effect. Look how much meat you can get out of this, guys. Yeah, right, you can make three shaka shakas with one chicken breast. Making it at home is cost effective. All right, it's breading time. We're gonna throw in some flour, cornstarch, breadcrumbs, salt, baking powder, and garlic powder. To the wet batter, just add your eggs, milk, salt and pepper, and whisk it up. Woo, good job. If you're a fan of Healthy Junk Food, then you know that we're a fan of The Batter Pro. You can pick one up at your local Amazon link in the description below. 
To get that signature double batter look, that crazy thickness that we saw in the video, we need to hit this up with the flour first. Toss them into our egg wash. Back into the batter pro. Julia is doing a technique called adding little egg crumbles. <laughs> then we flip again. And then we flip again. And then we flip. And guys, if you want to go that extra step, do you want to go with us? Because we're going to do a triple breading. Oh, yeah. This is that breading. Did you just make a boo? Oh my god, that's the boo! Throwback. Five minutes on the clock. 365. Julia, that's a work of art. I'm so happy. Yes, it is just fried chicken, but let's take it to the next level. We have to put it in a bag. You're gonna add that spicy powder. The seasoning consists of cayenne pepper, curry powder, and a little bit of paprika. Fold the bag and shaka shaka. Woo! Oh, JP, this is so good. Oh! Mmm, that is good. That is good. Oh, I feel my nipples sweating. <laughs> Woo! Oh, Lord! That is super hot. Are you serious? Apparently, there's a cheese version of the shocker. So, basically, what you gotta do. It's called the shocker, not the. This is the cheese packet that came from the Easy Mac and Cheese. Grab your bag, pick out a piece of chicken. Jamie, are you okay? I'm just sweating. Throw in your chicken, sprinkle a little bit of that. Chase. Okay, that's enough. Blow your nose. That's so hot still. <laughs> and then tear it. Yup, that's definitely <laughs> cheesy. It probably tastes like mac and cheese. <laughs> I'm pretty good. Guys, this is probably the coolest cheese hack I've ever seen. It's like Cheeto coated chicken. Mac and Cheetos, take notes. This is what you gotta do. Is this the greatest thing you've ever done? I just wanna eat chicken. We're saving the best for last, guys. The ginger pork. I think Julia loved this one. You didn't like it? It's very simple, guys. You're just gonna need pork and ginger. But this is teriyaki, because it needs a teriyaki patty. Julia, how do I do this? It's like a hot dog bun. We're just gonna eyeball this, guys. We don't wanna do too much, but just enough. We're just gonna form these into little pork patties. Where are my JPers at? How you peeing today? I drink a lot of water, so I, I've gone more than once. Is it clear? I didn't look. The next component is the ginger sauce. We're gonna throw in a third cup soy sauce, two teaspoons honey, balsamic vinegar, two tablespoons of ginger paste, one teaspoon garlic, and just half a teaspoon of sesame oil. Mix it all together, get it nice and hot, half a teaspoon of cornstarch and water. Slurry going in. Japanese food is so good. Look at that, Jules, it's beautiful. Oh my God. Oops. This trumps the Szechuan sauce, in my opinion. I haven't tried it yet, but I just believe it is. I think this is it. Did you make it? I did make it. You wrote this recipe yourself. Pat on the back. Yeah. The reason you press it down is because you don't want it to shrink up. If you take the paper off too soon, you can't press down on it anymore. A little trick I learned as a Boy Scout. You're a Boy Scout? No. Look at that perfect McDonald's thin manufactured pork patty, guys. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. In Japan, they put eggs on like all of their things. If it's breakfast, lunch, or dinner, so. Put down some butter, get one of these cool nifty egg things, pop it in there. And then this is the signature. You gotta make sure you break the yolk and let it run into the side. Oh my God, it looks like a yin yang. All right, this is a McDonald's egg, guys. That's perfect. I love this thing. McDonald's egg, cook it at home. It's easy. Huh? We were gonna do it in a mug, but it wasn't the right diameter. Watching ASMR? That I was Is that from ASMR? <laughs> we got everything ready. Let's build this thing. Okay? I've been waiting for you to say that. Okay. All right, you know how we do on healthy junk food. We gotta make things look perfect. So Julia's coming over with the pork sausage patty. Look at it, glisten. Next, with our green leaf lettuce. Look at it here. It's the same. It's almost, that almost looks too perfect on camera. I'm not even gonna lie. Mm. 
Dude, we made it. This looks fantastic. Very impressed. You're not gonna get that at McDonald's. If you don't come over here and take this from me, I'm gonna eat the whole thing. Oh, dude, I wanna try it. It's so good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, no. mm -hmm. You make ginger and pork proud. This ain't a versus. This is where we come together as one. We rule the world together. So make sure you guys head over to JP and Julia because we're gonna be trying all the fast food from around the world. Next stop, KFC Japan. You better watch that. And you can comment. Let us know what you wanna see and we'll make it. Then we'll put your comment in the video. All right, JP, let's go. We have so many people to feed. We gotta give them all the Shaka Shaka chickens. To the Shaka Shaka mobile. What are we gonna do with this? You are straight up a mouse. Go back in your home. Get back in, oh, you gotta do laundry. You are such a gremlin. <laughs> Where did, what just happened? Check out the related videos. To the stage right is the previous video. And to the stage left is the next video. Remember to thumbs this video up, subscribe, and as always, enjoy. <coughs> that was so spicy. That was good, you did a good job. Ooh, thank you.